Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a highly requested one. I'm finally sitting down with you to do my beauty room slash filming area slash where I bring clients sometimes everything happens in this room video. <laughs> That's a long title, I know. Uh, the lighting is a little off because I do not have all of my studio lights set up. I actually have them right there in the corner just so that they are out of the way while I do this video. I'm going to show you everything, my collection, how I store it, and just, yeah. You guys have never seen my room. <laughs> I have actually filmed this video seriously like four times since we moved into this house. I started with my room in a completely different room, changed it like twice, and then I moved it over into this room and I've changed it like three times over in this area and I think I finally have it where I like it. So now I feel comfortable enough to show you guys. So without further ado, Here's my room. All right, so I'm going to start right in from when I walked through, there was no door here, so I just hung these little things up. When you first walk in, you can see I have my backdrop holder with that backdrop on it right now. That is where all my lights and camera stand and stuff like that goes. I have my little bench here that I sit on when I film in front of that, just holding a few extra things. Over here I have this giant window that looks outside. There's just a bottle of wine from my wedding, some extra brushes, this little picture of me there, all cartoon style. Your little mirror that lights up okay from my wedding. Here is uh, all of my glasses. I actually found this case at a reuse it site in town here. It was the perfect find. It holds all of my prescription glasses beautifully. Down here is just a filing cabinet. It has all the paperwork for my business. This opens up. Here I've got just my little dragon and this Gucci box. In here I have extra backdrops and lighting equipment. I got a little shelf back there with the Storybooks cosmetic palette on it, a Chanel bag, some artwork. Here I've got all of my Pat McGrath palettes. Just some little wand brushes that I don't use. There's decoration. I have this thing here that I just hang my flat irons and blow dryers and my clippers and things like that. I have some random things down there. Uh, I have a couple of my certificates here. Light share for doing laser hair removal. This one is ear and nose piercings. Oh, that was just ear piercing specialist. I have a nose one. I've got my hair one and some other things. This is a canvas picture I got made. Those are all me with different face paints I've done on myself. Looking from, if I move back, I have, this is my desk. I've got my actual salon chair for when I'm doing haircuts and stuff. That is from Ikea. My desk is from Michael's. That is from Ikea and that is from Ikea. The mirror is a big round mirror I took from an old vanity. And then up here I have a couple of little shelves that look like books with all my Save Me From products. And here I've got Olaplex products, a little plant, my thanks for, you know, how many subscribers. I don't have these turned on right now, but those both light up. On the top of this, I have my Barberside jar. I got a little wine glass here with all of my eyeliners in it. 
this dude, he does light up. And of course we got a shot glass that says because COVID. On top of my main desk where I sit, I have this stand. This has all of my, well not all, but my eyebrow stuff that I love right now, lip liners that I'm using, all my sponges. These are a bunch of glosses that I like right now. My Marc Jacobs bronzer, Hourglass palette. Here, got some Rare Beauty highlighter. I used that today, it was so nice. In this guy, I have mascaras that I'm using right now. The top of this drawer, I have Anastasia Beverly Hills glitters. My Melt Cosmetics um, cream eyeliners and then some other cream eyeliners. Here I've got some eye primers and glitter glues. This is just some random, random things. These are all of my contact lenses. And just a couple pens. All right, and then we're gonna go over to this side. I have all of my brushes here. So this goes all my eye shadow brushes that I'm really loving right now. Cheek, face, um, cheek, like blush, bronzer, contour, and then these are all my complexion brushes. And then I have another one of these stands. These have all my Dora Cosmetics lipsticks, some other, these are just done by how they look. Some Too Faced glosses. Got some Fenty Beauty back there, more Fenty Beauty, more Jar Cosmetics. Here I've just got some more glosses, some mini lipsticks, some more lipsticks. Uh, not much in there, tweezers, sharpener. These are tiny little perfume samples. And then just some random things there. On the top of this Alex drawer, I have face products that I'm using right now. My perfumes, some creams, some brushes, those I don't really use, they're just for decoration. So yeah, that is kind of what's on there. Down here, I've got all my Juvia's Place palettes, just this little dragon container, another container, random stuff. These are all of my little Huda Beauty palettes. I love them. Here I've got some random mess things. Down here is some nail products. And then you go over to this side. I've got makeup wipes. Q-tips, those fluff ball things, my filming journal calendar thing, mirror. In this drawer, so this is where I sit to do my makeup. So right down here, in this first drawer, I have all of the complexion products that I'm using right now. These are all foundations in here. These are all primers that I'm using right now. Setting sprays. And I've been loving this Milk Hydro setting spray. Um, we got powders, concealers. That's, that's all that. Underneath here we have makeup products that I'm trying out and using right now. So we have all of these bronzers. And then we have blushes here. We've got another blush here, some highlighters. We've got the Patrick Ta Sculpting Duo, some Rare Beauty blush. We've got eyeshadow palettes. I haven't even, I used this once and I just can't wait to play with it some more. The Mary Jane palette. We've got some little Natasha Denona ones. Some Violet Voss back here. Got some highlighters. These are the stuff that I'm grabbing for on a daily basis. Here I've got some hair products. 
Here is brushes. And then this is empty right now. All right, so in this tall stand here, I have all my eyeshadow palettes. So these are all of my Anastasia Beverly Hills palettes. I absolutely love her palettes. You can see I collect them. In here is all of my Urban Decay and Kat Von D. Back here I've got the big palettes by Urban Decay and Kat Von D. This drawer is a palettes that I am really enjoying right now. Got some Marc Jacobs, Ghosts of Colors, Violet Voss, Busy Art, Melt, Melt, Melt. I love this Mercury Retrograde palette. We've got some more Violet Voss back here. And Kaleidoscope, some Natasha Denona under there. And this drawer is palettes that I don't really grab for too much anymore. They're still really good palettes. I'm not gonna get rid of them. I just don't reach for them as much because I have so many other things that I test out and try out. And here is just a bunch of lashes. I haven't tried these Glamnetic ones yet. I'm so excited to try them. Here is a bunch of lips. So these are all bullet lipsticks. These are all liquid lipsticks. In here I've got some more that just don't fit. I've got extra lip liners in here. This drawer is full of stuff I have not opened yet. I have not tested out yet. I actually just got all this stuff. This is all drugstore affordable stuff. I'm gonna be doing a full face of drugstore makeup very soon. This drawer is all of my special effects stuff. So I've got all my liquid latex, teeth marks. I've got all of my face and body paints, all this kind of stuff. Okay, this last bottom drawer, this is stuff that I'm not using. It's either stuff that I just never grab for, or it's the wrong color for me, or I don't like how it worked, or like all of these extra eyeliners and lip liners that I never use, that's what's in here. Now, this little stand, this is my hair trolley. So this one is on wheels. I will wheel it around, put my color bowls on it, anything I need for when I'm doing someone's hair. Top drawer, I have bobby pins, little hair ties, clips, random things. This is all of my headbands and wig caps, scarfs, got some glasses, cleaners, some earrings. <laughs> hair products and my gloves. All of my different hair pieces extensions, just a drawer of hair. Here I've got my nail light, my file, some extra little hair clips and random things in there. This wall I have hung up my ap apron and my cape and just an umbrella. Look over here and I have all of my wigs hung up. 
I've got the Beetlejuice thing from Melt Cosmetics. These are all of my setting sprays up in here. Here I have all of my scissors and clipper attachments. Some hair products. Some more hair products. Here is all of my Arctic Fox and Punky Color hair colors and Manic Panics, all my semi-permanents. And then at the bottom of this, oh, I guess we got these drawers. Here's my curling rod and attachments. My scale to weigh out color and random things. Under here is all of my developers, my color tubes, foils, Barber side, bowls, brushes, things like that. Okay, uh, what else didn't I show you? This, I didn't show you guys in here. Uh, this one does have stickers on it. My brother made me all those stickers. In here, like it says, I have all of my powders and primers. These are ones that I will rotate when I rotate my collection for keeping in those daily drawers. Uh, primers in here. Some more powders right here. And some more primers here. Skincare is filled with exactly what it says. Skincare items. Blush and bronzer. Got my uh, Fenty Beauty ones lined up in here, along with Ofra, these Dior palettes, I absolutely love Got the Anastasia, this is, what is this, Laura Mercier, got these Becca ones, Urban K, Drug Cosmetics, Mac, Too Faced, Galactic. I really like this one. Eyes. We have extra eye stuff. So extra mascaras, uh, eyelash curlers. This is all eyebrow stuff. This is all single eyeshadows and things like that. All of my foundations. So this section here is all concealers. And then I have like these mixer drops. And then it goes into all of my foundations. Longer tubes I keep back here. Palettes, I used to have eyeshadow palettes in here, but then I like moved it. Now I just have like my big highlighter palettes and stuff in here. This drawer doesn't have much in it yet. Face palettes, these are all like my bronzer contour kind of palettes. Some of them are blush palettes as well, full face palettes like these guys. And then I have all of my gels and my forms for doing gel nails. Little clips there, top coats, base coats, all these little gem-like things to stick on. I have not done my nails in so long. 
but I really need to. <laughs> oh, um, is that everything? Is that everything? I think I showed you guys everything. I have some more boxes back there. Gucci, Chanel, Louis Vuitton, some hats. This side, I don't want to show you. That side's not done. <laughs> My kids have kind of made a mess of it. But this is my room. I finally got it filmed. You guys have been wanting to see it. Here it is. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go and hit that subscribe button if you're not already a part of the Men's Beauty family. And if you want to be notified of upcoming videos, go and hit the bell. Anyways, guys, I'm going to end it with a goodbye mirror shot. Have a good day.